guys, you get me two days in a row. How about that? Liz Tierney here, um, also known as the lady with the six kids. We are making a dip. Now, I know many of you are probably like way smarter than me and have already figured this out like a long time ago. But for those of you who don't know, this is a super easy way to make um, a dip with any seasoning that you have that you, you know, if you really like the seasoning. So we're going to do one with our, um, the garden vegetable dip. This is our new one that just came out um, not that long ago. Um, so this is our three cup measure. Nope. Yep. Wait, measure is it three? Stop. Yeah, I think this is the three cup. <laughs> so we're going to add, I'm going to do a little bit of mayonnaise. I'm not really measuring this all that great. And I'm going to do some sour cream. So we got a little bit of both in here. The mayonnaise adds a little bit of, you know, little kind of different flavor. You could do Greek yogurt too. Um, um, and then it's just one, is it one tablespoon? Let me see. One tablespoon to one cup of sour cream, Greek yogurt, cream cheese, mayo, any combination of those things. So the more, and then so then it's going to sit. So I'm going to make this and I'm going to let it sit. The longer it sits, the stronger the flavor will be. Now you can do this with any of our seasoning. Like I said, everything but the pizza seasoning would be a fun little snack for your kids. Maybe dip, dip, in bread, dip breadsticks in it or something. Um, the everything bagel would be a good little dip to use. Um, this is a great one for veggies. I, we use this... Um, What's a snack that we like to do? Rice cakes with hummus and then sprinkle it with this. It's delicious. You could also do like your, you know, your peppers with hummus and then sprinkle this on it. It's really good. Um, rosemary herb, of course the dill, uh, sweet basil. Now here's a fun fact about our seasonings too. The lid doubles as a measuring thing. So you need one tablespoon. So I'm going to, if you fill this right up to the top line there, not all the way to the very top, but right to that very top line, it's exactly one tablespoon. So that's a fun fact for when you're cooking and you don't, you know, you like forgot to take your measuring stuff out. Same, the same thing does not apply for the bigger lid here. So I have a measuring spoon here. So we're going to do two, I kind of do heaping uh, tablespoons. And then we're just going to mix this up. And that's it, guys. This is as simple as that. Any seasoning you have, whether, you know, our wonderful Pampered Chef seasonings, which I prefer, <laughs> of course. Um, or whatever your favorite seasoning is. It's just a really quick and easy way to make up a dip. Um, you know exactly what's in it and you know you're not paying the absurd amounts of extra money to buy the prepackaged um, dip mixes because that's all these are. Is that's, I mean it's the same thing but you know those official dip mixes you're going to pay a lot more for than you're going to pay for you know, your favorite ranch seasoning or Italian seasoning to make a little Italian dip, whatever you want to do with it. Um, I've made it with the garlic herb dip. Uh, yeah, the garlic herb seasoning. That was good also. It was a little bit strong, like a little bit um, strong with the garlic, but I love garlic, so it didn't bother me. Um, but maybe it was a little spicy for like the young ones, the younglings. <laughs> Anyway, so now I'm just going to, this is it, guys. I have about two cups of the mix in here with a couple tablespoons of the dip. Um, I'm going to let it sit. If it's not, like, if I feel like maybe it's not strong enough, I may add a little more mix to it later before we use it. But that's it. And these these um, containers come with the lid, so they're super easy to just throw the lid on and pop it in the fridge. And there you go. All right, guys, I hope. <laughs> Oh, I have 19 kids. The ones that I have six kids, the other ones that I have 19 kids. Sometimes it feels like 19. I'm not going to lie. So. That's 1,500 million gazillion kids. 1,500 million gazillion kids. It's about that. Yeah, somewhere, somewhere <laughs> around that number. So anyway, I hope this helped some of you and you'll get, um, you know, make your own nice little super easy dip. If you're out of a dip mix, well, now you know how to make one. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Bye.